Let's move on to the next question. In the diagram we have the circle has center O and radius 5. This is 5, center is O. The points P and Q lie on the circle, okay? And uh, the length of PQ is 9. The length of PQ is 9, okay? This is 9 right here. Now, uh, the tangents to the circle at P and Q meet at the point T. Here we have the point T, but we know that P, T, and Q, T are tangents which means this is 90, and this has to be 90. Okay, great. Now we have to find the angle POQ in radians. Angle POQ, we have to find this value here. Pretty easy. Because we know the length of arc is given to you by the formula R times theta. R is 5, the radius. Theta is the angle, have to be 9. Theta will be 9 divided by 5 to find your value. That will be 1.8 radians as your value for the angle in terms of radians. Okay, now for part two, we have to find the length PT. PT will be this length. How can you find this length? So let's observe. We can first kind of break this down into two pieces. Half, half, right? This will become 1.4, obviously, because the whole thing, sorry, this is not 1.4, it will be 0 0.9 because the whole thing is 1.8, so 1.8 divided by 2 is 0 0.9. Now if you observe, we have a triangle that will be what? We have a right angle triangle. Here we have 5, and here we have the value of 9. And Sorry, this is not 9. Apologies, this is 9 here, and this is 0 0.9. And we're trying to find the length of PT. So PT, so pretty easy. Uh, we can use Socatois, obviously, right? So Socatois, let's see which one we will use. So we have this side, this is my A side, A and A. We're trying to find the O side, we have to use this. Now will be tan of 0 0.9, will be the opposite side will be PT over the A side. So PT will be 5 times tan of 0 0.9. I have to use radians over here, that will be 6.30. The length of PT will be 6.30 centimeters. Now what else? Uh, we have to find the area of the shaded region. So one by one. Uh, we can first find the area of, of this of half. So we forget about this one first because they're the same thing. Right. I think we have seen this kind of question many times as well now. We have somewhat of an understanding how we can proceed step by step to find that area. So we can forget about this half and look at this only. Find the area of the triangle first. That will be half time base is 5. Time height will be 6.3. That's the area of the whole triangle. Half times 5 times 6.3. That should be 15.75. Now, you want to minus the area of sector, which is the one that we don't want here. That will be half. All square is 5 and the angle is 0 0.9. So uh, answer minus half times 25 times 0 0.9. That will be 4.5. So 4.5 will be the area of this side. And we also have this side. So times 2, that will be 9.0. So 9.00 centimeters square for your area. And that will be your question in relation to circular measure.